what we're trying to do in, uh, with Spanish at Capen is we're trying to build in five levels, five possible levels of Spanish, Spanish one through Spanish five. This is in part to incentivize kids who've had um, Spanish in middle school to maybe consider seriously going into level two so that you could have um, Spanish two, Spanish three, a Spanish four that we're um, going to have four uh, credits, four hours of college credit through Newman University and Spanish five, which be, would be another four hours of college credit through Newman University. So that's an increase of four hours from what it is now. But it's split into, the idea is that it's split into two courses. So I'm excited for Spanish five because I didn't want to take a whole year where I didn't speak any Spanish before I went to college because I'm planning on minoring in Spanish. So it was a valuable class to take my senior year. And as someone that started in Spanish two, because I had Spanish my eighth grade year, it's nice to not have to stop for college. So the new course being offered next year is called Principles of Computer Science. It's a course offered through Project Lead the Way. So Project Lead the Way is a national program. Here at Capen, we have some engineering courses through Project Lead the Way. And they also have computer science courses. So we, just, we thought it'd be a good idea for us to just kind of piggyback on Project Lead the Way in our engineering program and offer a computer science course. Computer science, in my opinion, is super important. There's super high demand for it in the industry. You know, so all the gra people who are graduating with this major are instant, before they graduate, they're getting jobs. And they're getting good, high quality, high paying jobs. Um, it's a super, super important field because our entire economy is based on technology. So I'm gonna be taking computer science next year because I think it'll be a very like applicable class to my future and how we make big bucks. We are merging uh, the Paladin class and the mass communication. So Paladin's currently Journalism 2, so they're molding into that Journalism 2 class. It is based off of an idea called Convergence Media, which I saw presented at the National Scholastic Press Association conference in the fall. And it is basically updating what we do to the modern era of journalism. So if you wanted to be a journalist, you would be expected to um, create videos, shoot your own photos, write stories for print and for the website. So we're pretty um, segregated in our tasks currently. So this will just allow everyone to do a little bit of everything and make them more available to take on a working role. As a whole, uh, the MassCom Paladin merge is, uh, I mean, Paladin kids are going to have to learn how to make videos and uh, how to edit, like, using, um, like, the Adobe programs that we used to edit, which, is, that stuff's pretty hard to learn. So I think it'll, it'll be pretty hard the first few months when everyone's trying to get used to uh, learning how to uh, do everything that's required of them uh, in a staff where you have to make videos and write articles.